Welcome to the viewers. We discuss today the idea of local compact spaces. And to discuss with that, we at first going to the definition of local compact spaces. Start with the definitions. If a topological space X tau is locally compact then each point in X has a compact neighborhood and at first if we take the concept if x tau be any topological space and consider any point x and if this topological space is called locally compact then we say that it has a compact neighborhood suppose x be any point suppose and it has a compact neighborhood in this region and it's clear and x is arbitrary so all of x has its compact neighborhood and if we consider x tau is compact then it must be locally compact if x tau that indicate compact then this also imply x tau must be locally compact but now if x is infinite and tau is discrete topology then this x tau is not compact but locally compact as we consider it is an infinite and tau is discrete then there will be no compactness but it is locally compact that means each point that is a single turn has a compact NBD. So, however, all single turns of an open cover has no finite subcover because every open cover. every open cover for family of open set or closed set whatever may be tau has no finite sub cover so it is not compact and not every open cover that's why it is not compact but it is locally compact because every only single element if we consider then we find a compact NBD for a single turn. That's why it's have compactness. Now if we consider an example, it will be clear. For an example, in a real number, in real number space R with usual topology. is not compact but it is locally compact then how to show it 
for the part of proof R is unbounded. and clearly not compact and as we know that minus infinity less x less infinity it is we already cleared these ideas and if we consider a real line say any element if x and if any element say such delta greater than 0 the nbd that is any region if we say it x plus delta and x minus delta for the delta region if somewhere for the length we consider for any x belongs to capital R the closed interval If we consider x minus delta and x plus delta delta greater than 0 is a in bd of x and it is closed and bounded set And it is clear from Heinoborel theorem that every closed and bounded set is compact and hence it is compact because every closed and bounded set is compact. And we know that it is a compact NBD. So X belongs to R. each x belongs to R arbitrarily that is if we consider a singleton x then singleton x is a compact NBD and we declared it x belongs to R that has a compact NBD as any singleton x that is a compact nbd of x if we say and here if we consider this region any type of element such x is arbitrary here and we can say better to say that's a compact clearly and delta region so it is compact and better to say it is uh, locally compact without being compact and in this way so real number space R is locally compact we end our discussion today if you like this video like it share it don't forget to subscribe the channel thanks for watching